This is the River of Life body scan. Practicing it can bring you to a great sense of peace. You can practice this lying down or sitting up, whatever's most comfortable for you. If you choose to lie down, you might want to put a bolster under your knees and maybe a little pillow under your head, whatever makes you feel deeply, deeply relaxed. And you may want to put a blanket over yourself just to keep yourself warm. So get yourself very comfortable and breathe naturally. And maybe on an out breath, just release any sense of tension in the body. See if you can't get just 10% more relaxed. If you're lying down, you can let your legs relax and your feet splay out. If it's comfortable for you, you can have your palms facing upwards alongside your body. And as we do the body scan, I'll be asking you to place your attention on various parts of your body. You don't have to do anything. You don't have to move them. Just place your attention. And we'll start with the toes of the left foot. See if you can't note all the toes of the left foot. And now the top of the left foot and the sole of the left foot and the heel of the left foot. Note how the whole left foot feels. And you can say, this is my left foot. And now to the left ankle. And the left shin. And the left calf. And now moving up to the left knee, the kneecap. And the back of the left knee. See if you can't note a difference between your kneecap and the back of your knee. And now moving the attention up to the left thigh, to the front of the thigh, and the back of the thigh. Maybe notice a difference in pressure. And now to the left hip. See if you can't feel all the way into the left hip joint. And now place your attention in the entire left leg all the way from the hip down to the toes. You can hold your whole left leg in your attention. And now moving your attention to the right toes, the toes of the right foot. all the toes of the right foot. Maybe you feel a press of a blanket or a sock, or maybe the coolness of air. Whatever it is, you can note that. And 
and now the top of the right foot and the sole of the right foot and the right ankle. Now to the right shin and the right calf. See if you can't feel the difference between the right shin and the right calf. And now to the right knee. Feel all the way in to the joint of the right knee. And now to the right thigh, the front of the thigh and the back of the thigh. And now into the right hip. Feel into the hip socket. And now place both legs in your attention and feel the energy of the legs from the hips down to the toes. See if you can't radiate that energy up and down the legs. And now bring the attention to the pelvic girdle, the bones, cradling the organs. Sense the energy here. And now moving your attention to the lower belly. Maybe feel the breath moving the lower belly. to the belly button. Note whatever you feel here. And now to the diaphragm. Breathing in, note how the diaphragm feels. And just sense the diaphragm moving in and out with the breath. And now to the rib cage. Feel the ribs opening with the in breath. You might notice the difference in pressure of the back ribs when you breathe in against the floor or the mat. And now let's bring our attention to both of the shoulders at once. The tops of the shoulders the fronts of the shoulders, the backs of the shoulders, the shoulder blades. You can feel the whole shoulder area, the left and the right. And now to the left hand and all the fingers of the left hand. in the back of the hand. Now to the palm of the left hand. Maybe you notice a warmth or a tingling. Whatever you feel, just note it with open, friendly curiosity. And now to the wrist of the left hand.
the lower left arm. The left elbow. The crook of the left elbow. The upper left arm. And now moving your attention to the fingers of the right hand, all the fingers of the right hand. Perhaps there's a tingling here. And now the back of the right hand and the palm of the right hand. And the right wrist. Feel all the way into the right wrist. And the lower right arm. And the right elbow. And now the upper right arm. And now let's bring our attention to the back of the neck. Bring it all the way up the back of the skull. Over the crown of the head and down to the forehead. Let's rest our attention at the forehead. And now to the eyes. Maybe notice the skin around the eyes and see if you can't relax that just a little more. And the eyes and the eye sockets. Feel them resting. And now to the temples. both temples. And now bring the attention down the jawline, all the way to the chin, to the lips, the teeth, rest the tongue, And now to the throat, and from the throat to the heart center, feel into your heart center. And now imagine a beautiful protective light emanating from your heart. can be any color, but white is a beautiful healing color. So see if you can't bring a white light from your heart center, shining out, and bring the light up over the crown of your head, and drape it down over your head and your shoulders, all the way down your body, like a beautiful cloak of white light. Healing you, keeping you safe. Feel surrounded by this beautiful light. And now imagine your body as being very, very light, almost as if you could rise off the mat. You are floating. 
You are floating in a beautiful, warm river. And there is light coming through the leaves of the green trees. Shafts of warm, beautiful light cascading down. The sky is blue. And you are gently floating along this river. It's the river of life. And you are one with the river and the light. Floating. Calm. Carried in the current, protected by your light. Relax and feel the beautiful joy of being alive. Right now. And now bring your sense of your body back into contact with the mat, the floor, the chair. That sense of gravity, contact. And you might increase the depth of your breathing You might wiggle your fingers and your toes, bring a sense of vitality to your body. And give yourself thanks for having taken this time to experience the river of life.